Hi, I'm Jim Snell in the United States of America. It has been brought to my attention that some people may not be familiar with the actual installation of the air filter on the TRS. It's not difficult, but I need to point out that it is not perfectly round. It is oval shaped, so there is a correct position. It mounts against this little spring here. On the cage for the filter, there is a small nipple that protrudes through a grommet on the filter, and that falls down into that spring. The filter is oval shaped, not round, so it must go with the narrow side, side to side, and the long side up and down, as I'm showing here. And the reason for this is because there is a lip on the interior of the air box that seals the filter. I'm demonstrating here how it installs against that little spring, which has a little area in the bottom that captures that little nipple on the filter cage, which I will show in more detail in this video. That is the little nipple that falls down into the spring, and here we see the air intake tube and how it has an area for the cage to sit in, and you can see I'm demonstrating when rotated 90 degrees, the cage does not fit properly. When in its normal position, it fits down into that area. So looking at the filter here, you can see clearly that it is oval shaped. And it matches the oval shape of the cage. So you can see here that that is oval shaped as well. So they much, must match each other in that way. It's rather easy to determine the oval shape and then just hold the filter in your hand keeping that the long side up and down the longest part of the oval and then you just slide it down in there pulling back slightly on the spring and it falls over that sealing lip and you have a very good seal but if it's rotated 90 degrees if the if the oval shape is not correctly aligned then you can have not a good seal of the filter against the interior of the box that nipple is actually part of the cage and there's a grommet a rubber sealing grommet that's part of the filter element so when you have the two components apart, for example, when you're cleaning your filter, you can see here that that grommet has a hole in the center and that, that nipple on the cage plugs through that hole there in that grommet. And that nipple is what slides down over that spring as I explained previously. Here I demonstrate outside the air box how they fit together. So here's some pictures of what those components look like close up. That's the little spring and you can see here how that little nipple is slid down there on the spring and there's a little capturing point. Here you can see a close up. On the X-Track and on the standard TRS bikes the filter cover has one countersunk Allen right there in the front and it may just lift up but on some newer bikes it can be a little bit stuck there because it's nice and tight fitting so you may need to take a small screwdriver and just get under the edge of it to pick it up and it has two little prongs or feet on the back of it that tuck up under there so you slide it backwards as you install it and then the screw just goes back in there On the carbon fiber air box that's on the gold edition, it has three countersunk Allen screws of the same type that hold the lid on, as you can see here. And I speed it up so that it goes a little more rapidly as I show here, taking those off. And that lid just sits down on there, and there's a rubber gasket that it seals against. You can see how easily it comes off. There's the gasket I'm pointing out. That hole there in the front 
you can reach down through there with a smaller Allen wrench and you will release a screw I like to use a light to see what I'm doing you release a screw there that holds a, a water and mud deflector plate that's over the top of the air filter and then you can take that out carefully so as not to drop the screw and have to go looking for it there you can see how that is structured there's that screw I was speaking of set that aside then you can reach right down in there and get the filter very easy access as I show here it comes right out you can remember it's oval shaped so it only goes in uh, one way and put it right back in there if you don't take that shield flap piece off there I showed you it can be rather tedious trying to take the filter in and out and get it properly positioned this way you spend a little time taking that flap out of there and save a lot of time servicing the filter then just put the flap back in again don't lose that little screw and again I use my little pen light so I can see what I'm doing and you set that right back down in there and actually it goes together really nice as I show here this is a one cut I didn't do this repeatedly to try and get it right it fell right into place and that's how that works and the access is through that screw hole from the front part Again, check the gasket. Make sure you didn't disturb it when you were working on the filter. And you put your three screws in there lightly and then kind of tighten them in a cross pattern. Again, I show this in high speed to save a little time in this video. A little cross pattern tightening there and snug them up. And there you have it. It's that simple. On the 2020 Raga Racing model, the air filter box has some changes, a much larger intake opening there in the front. And it has a Lexan shield supported by a metal brace to keep water from dripping directly onto the filter. Very similar to the carbon box, but not the same. And it's best to take this one out, just as I had shown previously, by using the front mounting bolt. So that you take it out and put it in with the mounting brace attached to it. That way, you have direct access to the filter. If you don't take it out and put it in like this, it's possible you could scrape your hand on the mounting braces. It hangs out over the top to support that Lexan shield. And it's accessed the same way as the carbon box down through that front access lid hole with your Allen. And this is what it looks like looking down upon it. Thank you for watching my video. Best regards in sport, Jim Snell in the United States of America.